Well, the weather calm now, but the city of South Padre Island getting ready for hurricane season. We're just over a month away from the start. Channel 5 Cecilia Gutierrez explains their first line of defense. From Beulah to Dolly, one thing remains constant on South Padre Island, sand dunes protecting you from storm surge. Anytime we have uh, any kind of high tide, major storm, uh, we are a bar our barrier island. We have that dune system there, and that is going to be our first line of defense. With the lack of a seawall, the dunes take the first hit when it comes to storm surge. That's why with hurricane season fast approaching, the city is making sure those dunes are up to the task. When we do have an opportunity to go out there and plant and reinforce the dunes, we will. In a category one storm with winds up to 95 miles per hour, storm surge can reach five feet, usually with minimal damage. A category two storm like Hurricane Dolly, storm surge can be up to eight feet. This can cause damage to nearby property. One of the keys to making sure the dunes are strong enough to handle storm surge is vegetation. Without the vegetation, you just have a pile of sand that is gonna easily blow around because of our strong winds we have here. What's really cool about it is their roots, um, are they not only just grow down, they grow out and um, they're intertwined with other roots. The Shoreline Committee is also making sure the beach walkovers are in shape before beaches reopen so people don't disturb the natural habitat. If you have a walkover, you get that foot traffic off the, off the dunes and it allows them to grow underneath so you have a continuous dune system there. The city is also working with the Army Corps of Engineers and GLO on dredging projects that add sand to near shore berms and eventually add sand to the island. Cecilia Gutierrez, Channel 5 News at 6.